That was fun. This RV, this one is not supposed to be here. Good morning guys and welcome back on this rather overclouded day. After I said my goodbyes to Jürgen, I settled off. Well, I somehow lost the audio of this day or a part of it, so let's start with the music. Hope you enjoyed this beautiful views here. Let's go. It's go time. Quick, 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 quick. I don't want to get stuck behind anything here. Wow. This is a yard, eh? Yep. Not a small one, guys. That is not a small boat. Look at it! Oh, holy! That is just stunning! Wow! 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 Nope! Can't stop here! Nope! <laughs> this saw for a minute. I need to get my drone out, but nope! No! 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 can't stop every five meters that is not possible hey do you remember this view no i do there was a big ass ferry standing right here and now i'm back and now i'm back for another burger 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 but this time i can sit outside last time it was raining all right, let's go get me something to eat for lunch. And it's go time, boys. I only did 160 kilometers so far. Um, if we don't count the ferries. So, yeah, that is only on the motorcycle. head in the opposite direction as we are came in here roughly four and a half weeks ago I uh, forgot to close my helmet once again what is this All right, that was fun. <laughs> oh, what the hell is going on here? <laughs> okay, that's the first of this trip. I mean, I had cows on the street, but ah, so many. There are even more. 
What is this? And then there's this sign here. Sheep with babies. Yes. But as you saw, I used my chance to overtake everybody. And now I'm free to go. Is few though, wow. This valley is just magnificent, absolutely beautiful. There's still a lot of water coming down. Look at the masses flowing down here. Wow, that is some force. The fur is here. Quick. No, it's leaving. Wow, that's bad. <laughs> All right, then we have to wait, I guess, until the next arrive. Ta da! And I caught up with the Norwegian guy. Where the hell are you going, buddy? Boom, boom, boom. Hey. All right, let's get off this thing here. There it is, ta-da! Wow! Look how amazing this thing looks like, eh? Wow! Wow! This thing is bonkers. That is one of the most beautiful churches you will find here in Norway, especially in the south. Um, this is actually the only one I could find here in hundreds of kilometers. All right, guys, I found something 20 minutes from here. Um, yeah, it's just a homestay, something like that. Nothing too crazy, but it's 64 euros for the night. That is the cheapest I could find now in this couple of minutes. I looked up for it, so yeah, 20 minutes, let's go. Well. I want to show you something, if we can get a glimpse over there, 
is the biggest waterfall I've seen so far. Wow, this thing is huge. Uh, what are you doing? Learner, okay. Holy moly. This thing is huge. Wow. Well, I guess we have to backtrack tomorrow a little bit from the accommodation. Because this is where I'm heading now, but it's actually off the track that I pre-planned. But, well, in this way, I don't want to ride anymore. That is the place. All right, let's go find the reception and check in. Then I will put my stuff away a little bit here. Um, bum, 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 bum. Oh, let's park here. So oh, it's 7.30 in the morning. Time to go. The bike is parked here in the barn. Get it out now, pack my stuff, and then I booked the ferry for later today. That means we have a road to cover, and I'm not even convinced yet that I will make it. So we will see, but first let's go check out the roads ahead. Let's get my ass out of here. No, what is this? Please, no fog, come on. Is it really so early this time? I mean, it's only eight o'clock, but hey. Why it's so foggy? That is so unnecessary. All right, I made it down. Wow, this thing is even bigger than I thought. What? You guys still with me? Because I went through the fog. Holy moly, that is a big boy. Take one last look at this beauty over there. This thing is huge. Couldn't even go on to the top. Affolz. Maybe that's the name. Affolz. Not quite sure. So, the river to my right is carrying a lot of water. And it even seems like it's unusual how much it carries, because it's like not only full. Already step off, step out of the riverbed here. At least this is what looks like in my eye. Let's see how swollen it is. Wow. Holy moly, I don't see anything. My visor is fogging up. Eh. Let's get out of this valley here. So much water coming down the river. Wow. No wonder after all the rain in the previous weeks 
They had some issues here. Sun is coming out a little bit. But it's not warming up. This river is 100% step out of the riverbed. You can see that even the trees that should not supposed to be in the water are in the water. See that right here? Well, I mean, there's still like one and a half or two meters to go. So this thing completely steps over, but oh, I don't want to be here to see that. That is for sure. This RV, this one is not supposed to be here. So that means we in the region where the floods happened. So much stuff everywhere, guys. See that? There should no water supposed to be left or right to my side here. Look how high the water is here. Wow. Oh, big moly. You can see all the destruction here. Wow. This is bad. Kinds of stuff in the water as well. <laughs> Looks like there's a waterfall upcoming here, eh? I think we have to check this thing out. If it's possible, of course. I would like to get my drone out, but it's really windy here. I'm not quite sure if this would be safe. Stop here for a minute, yes. This thing is just massive. Biggest waterfall I saw so far here in Norway. At least from this close of a distance. All right, guys, we made it. I got a tip yesterday via Instagram that there is another church here. Wow! This thing is massive, eh? Let's put the bike down somewhere. Hiking at a water park.
Very cool building, but it smells like burnt wood. That is where this one gets its color from. Unfortunately, still have a little bit more than 100 kilometers to go. Therefore, it's time to head to Larvik because I want to do some shopping here because they have a little bit of stuff that I quite surely need to bring home all right guys it's still 18 kilometers till the ferry but I'm looking for a spot where I can go shopping um, close by in Larvik. Quite sure there will be a shopping mall or something or at least a convenience store or grocery store. You will see. Wow. Hey. Nice. Nice bay area here. Turning into a river it seems. A lot of construction going on here for the last, I don't know, 10 minutes or so. And they even digging a brand new tunnel or a pair, I have to say. But it's like a short one, maybe like 100 meters. Nothing too crazy. All the board, what? All right, I'm in Larvik. It's not that far anymore to the harbor. Shopping is done. Already prepared my stuff for later, at least a little bit. Now I want to go to the Circle K. Munch away something the last time, hopefully. But maybe not, because Circle K is also common in Denmark. So, yeah. But I think it's the fastest, the cheapest option. Or maybe not the cheapest, but the fastest it is. And there is one just right around the corner here, so... I can see it. Uh, are we allowed to go in here? Maybe, maybe not. I don't care. I just wanna go there. Uh, oh, where can we park? Denmark, Denmark, guys! You back to Denmark we go Ooh. Hi. Uh, there is the ticket Reinhold. yeah that's me Hello? need my ID no okay thank you Lane number one all the way. There are already bikes waiting? Uh, I think there's some bikes that uh, didn't understand me there in the middle. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I would just go first place here. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> first place. First row all the way in the front. guys it's time to board one of the Dutch guys' helm dropped <laughs> and now he's missing a spring or something 
but hey we have to board so that was the worst timing possible Peace one but I make it on the ferry here so now I'm looking for my seat this time I uh, made a reservation only 10 bucks so I don't care now let's go hi guys the sun just set and uh, there's land already inside you can see it over there is the moon the sun just set over there and all the way there there's already the land, so this is Denmark. I booked my hotel already, so I will stay in the same hotel that I stayed before I went to Norway. And yeah, now it's like half an hour left, so I'm quite sure there will be soon the announcement to go down to the bikes and prepare everything, and then we are off. Should be just a short hop, like five minutes or ten minutes to the hotel. And yeah, then tomorrow it will be a super long day and the day after even longer. It's go time! We arrived in Denmark. And we are allowed to go off the boat with the trucks. So they wedged us in a little bit, but hey. Well guys! That was Norway, time to close this chapter, I guess, and off to a new one, yoohoo, <laughs> yeah baby, I already have plans for the next week, the next weekend and the upcoming month, so stay tuned for that, I'm quite sure that will be something really cool all right as you can see over there is the Skagen hotel this is where I stayed the last time let's see is the room taken this time ah uh, looks free so I checked in it's kind of like coming home cell phone connects to the Wi-Fi the lady knows who you are what is this <laughs> so I got kind of not the same room unfortunately because this one is already taken and I forgot to write down the room number because I didn't think I would come here again but hey so this time I'm at the other building so my building is this one right here and let's put the bike down exactly here so as you might remember my room was on this building over there to my right and on the far end and now I'm this side and my room is the second one we can go inside right here once it's dark, let me shed some light in this room here. Look, look, ta-da! So the room number is 1307. So if you're ever in the Skagen Hotel, you might be here. Check out one of these rooms. And I will also check on the other room number. Because that one is even cooler. 
So yeah, but I think that's it for today. So I will call it a day here. Bye bye, and I see you guys tomorrow morning when we head uh, through Denmark and then to Germany.